Lords, 48th Annual Paso. Sunday, April 9th at sundown. $100 per person or $100 per family. Driver Community Center, Co-op City, the Boogie Down Bronx, New York. 177, Driver Loop, Bronx, New York, 10475. $100 per person or per family. Send your funds in today, no excuse. Down from $150, thanks to Commander Johnny Johanna. He pay your way, pay for somebody else's. Send in your funds today, no excuse. Isaiah 41, verse 16. And Lebanon is not sufficient to burn, nor the beast thereof sufficient for a burnt offering. So, like I said, you could burn all of these, uh, you, you could burn the whole Lebanon and the Lord wouldn't care. But our people have to get it in our mind and separate from these other nations. Right. We have to separate from these other nations. Because the Lord created us to be a, a holy people. Right. right? So, in the Christian church, they tell you holy means, um, I, something they, I don't know, because they never really explained it to me. <laughs> they, they be like, you are we holy? But we, we are supposed to be one nation under God. But that's what America says. But there is no one nation under God under liberty in America. Right? So, like I was saying, we're supposed to be a separate nation. We're supposed to be a separate nation. Right. We're not supposed to be cleaving to these to these other nations and the so-called white man. That that has been the destruction of our people. Martin Luther King has betrayed our people. And there are a lot of people like Martin Luther King in the black Hispanic community. Right? But the Lord gonna fix that. But go to Isaiah chapter 30 and verse 1. Right? Because Christianity, Islam, and all those other religions are doctrines created by white people to destroy our people. They have nothing to do with the Most High. Read what you got. Isaiah chapter 30, verse 1. Woe to, wo to the rebellious children, said the Lord, that take counsel, but not of me. The Bible said, woe to the rebellious children that take counsel, but not of me. So what is, what is the counsel that our people take? But we don't take from the Lord. All the, we, we into all these other doctrines. Right? We, we out here voting, trying to see what President Obama going to do. He ain't do a damn thing. Right? We in the Christianity. We taking counsel, but it ain't of the Lord. Right? Islam. Right? Rastafarian. We taking all this different counsel, but it ain't, it, ain't, it ain't the spirit of the Lord. That's why you got all this homosexuality going around. Right? Because most of all of those religions produce homosexuals. Christ, the Christian church is full of homosexuals. Christianity is a homosexuals religion. It's the only, well not the only place, but one of the only the places you can go and be a homosexual and be accepted. That, right, because the Christian church is known for having homosexual choir directors. Right? It's accepted in there. Like, you almost got to be a homosexual just to be in the Christian church. Yeah, they praise dancers. They praise dancers be men. Right? You got to be a homosexual to be in the Christian church. That's why most brothers don't go to the Christian church. It's full of women. Because we know black women love homosexuals. Right? And cool niggas. Right? That's right. Right? I should be K under Commander General Yana. We are men of the Lord. That's right. Right? Read what you got. What, what else? Read that. Start that, start that verse over again. Read it again. Woe to the rebellious children, said the Lord, that take counsel, but not of me, and that cover with a covering, but not of my spirit. The scripture said they cover with a covering, but not of the Lord's spirit. So we know that the Lord's spirit is this Bible. Right? Keeping the law, statutes, and commandments of the God, of the Lord. Right? You can't be no homosexual. Right? You can't raise up no army full of homosexuals. Right? The, Christi the Christian church is a house of Satan. Right? Made up by the white man. Just another tool to destroy black people. Destroy black households. Right? 
Read that again. Woe to the rebellious children, said the Lord, uh-huh. that take counsel but not of me, uh-huh. and that cover with the and, and that cover with a covering, but not of my spirit, uh-huh. that they may add sin to sin. That they may add sin to sin. They double sin. They just they are adding sin to sin. Right? right? Keep reading on that. Verse 2. That want to go down into Egypt and have not acts at my mouth to strengthen themselves in the strength of Pharaoh. Right? So the, the word said they walk down to Egypt. We know Egypt is a Greek word that means slavery. They walk go down to Egypt, you know, but they haven't asked the Lord to free us out of this captivity. They ain't asked the Lord. They want to go vote down there, go down to the voting booth, let's see if Obama can free us. Let's see if Obama can free us. We're going to go vote. This Negro ain't do nothing for black people, and they hold, they hold him to such a high esteem. You got to tell it. Read what you got. Oh my God. That walk to go down into Egypt and have not asked at my mouth to strengthen themselves in the strength of Pharaoh and to trust in the shadow of Egypt. That strengthen themselves in the strength of Pharaoh. That's what that's what you got our 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 so-called leaders. They think they're gonna do something when they come a part of this man's system. Like you think you're gonna help out the black community or something if you become a cop for the white man. You think you're going to go do something if you go go join, you're doing the right thing if you go join the man, white man's army. You just become a part of their system. That's right. You, you talking about, oh, I'm going to go, I'm going to go, I'm going to work inside so I can help change things. It ain't a Negro I have seen work for the white people change anything for black people. That's right. It ain't one. That's a lie. But all of that comes from the Christian church. They teach you that you can do that, that you can join your old person, and it's okay, right? When they shooting black people down in the streets, when they shooting black people down in the streets, do you see any black officers, or any black officers trying to help save black oppressors, black people? Right? It's, it's like that. What else you got on that? Read what you got. Verse 3. Therefore shall the strength of Pharaoh be your shame. The Bible said, therefore shall the strength of Pharaoh be your shame. All people trusting in America, the strength of America is going to be our shame. That's going to be our shame. Because we putting all our trust in the so-called white man system. Oh, they, let's, let's march for justice. You ain't finna march for justice. Marching ain't gonna get you nowhere. White people don't march. When injustice happens to their people, you know what they do? They tear up the goddamn city. That's what they do. That's what white people do. How you gonna ask this, the man that oppressed you for 400 years and took away all your rights? You you gotta get civil rights. You gotta ask a man, can can you live and you not can you not kill me, Mr. White Man? Can you not kill me? You gotta beg the white man. You know? That's what the Christian church produces. Weak men. Weak effeminate men that believe in that system. But we believe in the Lord. We at the ISUPK under command of General Hong, we believe in the Lord and keeping his law, statutes, and commandments. And like I, Psalms chapter 50, 50 verse 16 say, he going to deal with them. The Lord going to deal with them. He going to bring justice to the, native, to, uh, to the nation of Israel. That's what the Lord going to do. Right? So, let me see. Read what you got. Keep reading on that. And the trust in the shadows of Egypt, your confusion. Verse 4. For his princes were at Zom, and his, and his ambassadors came to Haines. So like that's it on that. Give me uh, Hosea chapter 4 and verse 6. Because all, all people lack the knowledge of this truth, of this Bible. And that's why we come out into the highways and the byways trying to teach our people and wake them up according to these scriptures. Too much scripture. All right. Give me Hosea chapter 4, verse 16. Because our people, we're going to go precept upon precept. Right? Now, read what you got. Hosea chapter 4, verse 16. For Israel slided back as a backsliding heifer. Hosea chapter 4, verse 6. Lock it. 
Hosea chapter 4, verse 6. My people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge. The Bible said, my people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge. Right? What is the knowledge that our people, is, what is the knowledge that the scripture talk about? Give me Malachi chapter 2, verse 7. Right? Right? The knowledge that the scriptures is talk about is what? Keeping the commandments of God. Jesus Christ is a so-called black man. Right? God is black. The angels are black. Right? The white man is the so-called devil that the Bible speak of. He's the devil. He's the one raping, robbing, pillaging the whole earth. Right? And he got his media trying to look like that he's the innocent one. We see you, white devil. We see you. The Lord see you too. Malachi chapter 2 verse 7 Malachi chapter 2 verse 7 For the priest's lips Should keep knowledge And they and they should seek the law at his mouth So this is what we should, we should do While the white man is raping, robbing, pillaging the whole earth We should seek the Lord And keep the law Right? Because guess what? The patience and the faith of the saints is for what? The white man to go into captivity. To be a slave. He going to be a slave. That's what he going to be. In the kingdom. Kingdom of heaven. And guess what? The first time he break a commandment. Uh, the first time he break a commandment. I'm going to whip his back till it's purple. That's what's going to happen. Read what you got. Read that again. Malachi chapter 2, verse 7. For the priest's lips should keep knowledge, and they should seek the law at his mouth. For he is the messenger of the Lord of hosts. So the priests, which are all the men of the ISUPK, we keep the law of the Lord in our mouth. Right? So, you know, I'm Officer Manatizak. Office of Monotis, I go to ISUPK on the command of Jeremy Hunter, one West Harlem, New York. We are not affiliated with any fake Israelite group, any Christian homosexual, right? 